percent, a hundred percent. Um, on a super chat here, Shakur going to do Edwin De Los Santos so bad they're going to think he's nobody. Keep up the work, good, good work. So, how is that that feeling as far as like you know you 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 that good that you can make a good fighter look mediocre? Do you feel like that's what was gonna happen with De Los Santos as well? Uh, I don't know. We gotta wait and see, but I do feel like I am in the situation that uh, when I do make fighters look bad and beat them up, uh, the first thing that they gonna run to is oh, this guy wasn't that good, or this guy is not nobody. Um, They're going to take away from my resume, same way they did with Bud. Um, Just like my last fight. My last fight, they turned the dude that I was fighting, and they say he's a cab driver. But um, I want to say his fight before he fought me, he fought Nakatani. Mm -hmm. And uh, no disrespect to T.O. T.O. had, what, a majority decision with Nakatani. Lemachenko, it took him nine, I want to say nine or ten rounds to get him out of there. That dude got him out of there in six. So um, he couldn't be as bad as how they made him seem. But I think I'm just in a lose lose situation when it comes down to it because anybody that I fight, uh, they're going to act like I didn't fight nobody. In. Even with Edwin. Edwin is a great fighter. But um, after I beat him, they, they're going to sit there and say that he wasn't as good as um, I'm saying he is. This fight coming up with uh, Regis Pro Grays and Devin Haney, what do you think about it? Uh, it's a great fight. Great fight. Um, I like I like Regis. Regis, um, real cool dude. Uh, he's definitely a hundred. Like he he a real. You can tell like certain people is real niggas, and uh, Regis is a real motherfucker. Um, right. I watch his interviews. I watch the way he carry himself. Um, it's nothing but love and respect to Regis. Um, I sparred him before, and just to hear like him talk about the sparring to the world. Uh, with no pride or nothing like that, he he big me up. Um, it's definitely a lot of respect to Regis, so uh, definitely a great fight. Um, let's see. Yeah, I, I talked I talked to Regis about your sparring as well, and he just you know he just claimed up that it was sparring. I've heard rumors as well, um, but in the same time, um, yeah, sparring and you're sparring. right. All that shit don't even that shit don't count. None of that shit count. At the end of the day. Sparring is for you to practice and get better. A hundred percent. And you're right. He is a real one because, you know, in his last fight, he, he I remember the camera came up. I don't know if you remember. And he was like, oh, I did get knocked down. And, like, for someone to say that in, you know, in national television, that goes to show you the type of caliber person he really is. Yeah, he's not He's not a social media person. He's like a real, like, dude. Like, he'll tell you, like, he one of them dudes that's going to take the real. Oh, I, I respect Regis. Who do you favor in that fight? Uh, I'm I'm gonna definitely go with uh I I, I don't know they both coming off um mediocre performance so correct. Uh, it's definitely gonna be a good fight. It's um definitely gonna be interesting to see. Another softball. Devin. Yeah, if he, if he can if Devin can handle that power at uh 140, so uh, we'll see. I can't really make a prediction for it. Um, as you get close, I'll probably give you a prediction. But I, I would have to go, like, sit back and watch um, Regis' last fight because I, I haven't really seen too much of Regis lately. I just know from, like, me sparring him. 